Hello, my name is Zornitsa and I'm your Y class instructor. In this video, we're going to talk about how to add locations and how to manage them. So, as you can see, there are three ways to create new locations. There is the Mario method, the quick method, and also the import method. We're also going to talk about how to manage your locations, how to add an icon for each location, and how to add a location widget to a website. So let's get to it. Now you have to open your admin panel, then click on classified and search for location. By clicking on location, this will appear in front of you. As you can see here on the right, there is some option, new location. There are some options like new location, import, quick creator, import geonames, locations. So let's start by clicking on new location. Now, we will create a location, let's say New York. We're not going to put parent or a CEO name nor description, but these are options you will use further on. So I'm going to click on create. And now here it is my location as we set it. Now, I'm going to use the quick creator, which you actually use to create multiple locations. I'm going to Once over here on the right, or if you want to delete, you also use the delete option. I'm going to edit downtown now just to show you. Now I'm going to put downtown on the Manhattan um, and then I'm not going to add an order. Or latitude as you can see these options are available as well you can use them actually the latitude and longitude are pretty cool because the location will appear on the map I'm gonna click submit now and as you can you can see it but downtown is on the Manhattan Manhattan is apparent of it so now I'm just gonna put Manhattan on the New York as you can see you can do that by dragging this um, now I want to put an icon here so I click edit the home location of parent of Manhattan we say I would put New York I'm going to choose a file. Okay, so here is the picture I chose. I'm going to click Submit. So it will appear now on our website. Here it is. Now, apparently, I will click again the parent. Yeah, location and Submit again. So now I want to show you how this actually looks like. As you can see, you can't immediately see the locations. They are not displayed yet, as we haven't used the location widget. But now, when you click on Publish New, to publish new advertisement, we already selected category. Okay, I'm going to select property. Now, under location, you can select New York, then Manhattan, and then downtown as i've put it on the manhattan then you have all of the other options like own address and publish new now as you can see actually the locations are already displayed here but i want to show you how to put them 
over here at the sidebar. So let's go back to locations. Now you would like to find appearance and then click on widgets. Now by clicking, you can see all of these options. We're looking for locations to display locations. Now um, they're already displayed at the sidebar, it says, but actually they're the first, so I want to put them at the sidebar. Okay, so I'm gonna click on save changes and I will remove them from the footer by clicking on edit and then clicking on delete. Okay, so I deleted that already and they should appear just on the sidebar. Let's reload the page so we can see how it actually looks like. Okay, here are our locations. Actually, you can put them here, you can put them at the sidebar, you can put them at the bottom as well. It's really up to you, it's whatever you prefer. You have the option here to be flexible. They can be uh, also inactive, you don't have to put them out there, but I would recommend to have them. Not compulsory though. Okay, well, thank you for watching this video. I hope it was helpful. See you in the next one.